Columbus Superconductors is an Italian company focused on MGB2 superconducting wire production. MGB2 or magnesium diboride is a well-known material since more than 50 years, but its superconductivity has been realized only relatively recently. Today, superconducting materials are extensively used in magnets when a high magnetic field is required in a compact volume. This is the case, for instance, in magnetic resonance imaging systems, which have become a readily available diagnostic technology, in spite of the fact that each system contains about 50 km of superconducting wire, cooled down at a temperature of 4 Kelvin, placed just at a few centimeters of distance from the patient. The upcoming future of superconductivity is first foreseen in energy applications because its losses capability to conduct electricity is the most promising solution to make energy generation, transportation and storage more efficient than today, saving a significant amount of CO2 emissions. Space applications of superconductivity are the next step. Space application will profit not only on the inherent increase in efficiency, but also the significant weight and volume reduction with respect to traditional components. Among superconducting materials, MGB2 has the chance to become the material of choice for space applications, because it is by far the lightest superconducting material with the highest operating temperature. We at Columbus Superconductors are working within SR2S to develop a suitable wire processing technology to make MGB2 ready for the strict requirements of space applications. Wire performance, weight and strength will be optimized by our team in this direction. MGB2 itself is the lightest technical superconductor available in the market, which is one of the features making it worthy to be used in space applications. However, the wire is also composed of a nickel matrix which permits of keeping the superconductive powder tightly packed in a shape of long and thin wires. The drawback is that nickel has a quite high specific weight, 9 grams per cubic centimeters. For the purposes of the, this project, we are developing a particular process in order to substitute the nickel matrix with a lighter one, which is titanium. Titanium is amongst the lightest metals, having a specific weight about one half of nickel, but conserving very good mechanical properties. And we are also substituting the copper of the stabilizing strip with aluminum, which has about one third of the specific weight of the copper. In the end, the new architecture aims to reduce the overall weight to almost one half of the original wire, improving in the meanwhile, the current transport properties. From age to age, the human being feels the desire to reach Mars. This will be reality in the next years. However, the trip in deep space will take more than six months. Traveling in deep space means exposing the astronauts and the equipment to galactic cosmic rays and the solar energetic particles, which are thought to cause a significant increase in the probability of a various types of cancers. The long duration permanence in deep space will be possible only properly shielding the astronauts from the ionizing radiations. The purpose of SR2S project will be reached designing realistic magnetic shields suitable for a space mission. Due to the duration of the exploration mission, this magnetic system must be based on a technology such as superconducting magnets able to operate continuously and reliably for years. Such system will be also modular and weight and size saving Mind you that adding one kilogram in deep space means an increase of a cost equal to $15,000. MGB2, the key of success.